Bard for the first time, starting today, is going to be live in France, as well as the rest of Europe. Not only will it be available here in France, but Bard will start to speak in French, uh, as well as over 40 other languages. There's several new features that are going to be made available globally. The first is the ability to collaborate with images. Say you have uh, a bottle of wine that you're really excited about in your home. Bard will help you think through what are the different sorts of foods that I could pair with this. Another thing that, that's coming uh, to Bard this week is the ability to pin uh, and save your recent threads. You're going to be able to revisit a conversation or an idea that you were exploring. You can also read the responses out loud been a profoundly difficult problem to take the world's information and organize what already exists to narrow to find what you need. What tools like BARD, being direct access to a language model, allow us to do is take that next step. Not just take the information that's been narrowed, but expand and create into new possibilities. We're so excited and inspired by the way that people have been using BARD, and we're so excited to see what will be created here in France.